我走。Alright, guys, we're back in Garner's Bridge Drifters, and right now we're going to take a look at S Stargazer once more. Now, why exactly are we reviewing this again? The Awakening for Legacy SE cars are here. What you can awaken among all of these Legacy SD cars are Adjudicator, Spirit Breaker, Optimus Reno, Stargazer, Oath of Stars, Dawnbreaker, Light Chaser, Skywalker, and Isol. Here are the awakening stats of a Stargazer. From the looks of the awakening stats here, you might be in a 50% chance or 60% chance to overtake uh, a Starlight now. Those who doesn't know Stargazer yet, here's the characteristic. Natural power plus 12%, natural time prolonged by 1.2 seconds, but if you drift, it will end the nitro time right away, and end tank automatically fill up by 2% per second. Recommend speed modding for this car is... Left, 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 and middle. Or unless, if you're much of a minibus timing fan, yeah, you could go for the left branch on the turbine here. Alright, let's get started. Alright, normal speed is 202.7. Double boost, 246.7. DWW, 311.1. LTW, 293.6. That's the nitro. And turning, it seems to be strong actually. Seems to be. Delta W fifteen point seven. Be mindful that it only increases like natural power. It doesn't really increase uh, any speed or something. Actually, did we check that correctly? If that was on Legacy S League buff or all Acre buff? They're very different, keep in mind that. Oh no, wonder. Wait. Isn't this car supposed to be Legacy 2? Well, anyways then. We're gonna use the old A car uh, effect here then. We'll take that. Alright, we'll do 3 games of Frank here. And then we'll do CT11 as the penultimate test. Interesting choice. That's not how you use it, Jesus. God damn it. Ah. Uh. Let's do it right this time. There you go. If no mistakes are made, actually, you might be in the same time with, uh, as starlight.
To be honest, this is actually an interesting map to test. on the attention move. Performance is way too similar. I didn't expect that. Last one before we move to CT11. Well, that's also interesting. Since that's a long map. Nice. Oh, someone's <laughs> rocking with a frog, let's go! <laughs> okay, it already ended. Or maybe I might be late. I forgot this is a mini boost uh, power thing. It's not the timing. That's why. Wait. I mean, it's alright. You can actually do better than that if you set the turbine to the left branch, which is increasing your mini boost timing. Also, didn't I race these maps long ago already? I think I've done them already. Oh well, we're gonna rock on CT11 then. That's our final test. Wait, actually. Uh huh.
I'm fucking this up at my. That ain't good. Ah. You know what? Uh, fine. I guess I'll take that. Cope. What was that? Ay yo! Oh well. The run's almost good. The run's almost good. I'll give it that. God damn it. Alright. Concussion for a Vulcan as Stargazer. The whole stats are actually that bit similar to as Starlight or as Brilliant basically. Power, speed, and probably end tank collection. They're actually almost the same, but their characteristics are different. See right here? Uh, Stargazer only has 1.2 seconds of natural time alone, while well, S Brilliant here has. Where is it? 1.6 seconds of natural time prolong. And tank fill up by 2% per second for Stargazer, while S Brilliant here has 3.5% and tank per second and natural power plus 12% which actually takes effect for the whole race but for S Brilliant natural power plus 20% only if you activate the star butterfly form just like after you use 6 times of nitro this one right here lasts for only uh how many seconds again? ah 50 seconds this one is a downside but this is a total win but overall Stargazer might take a win here actually, it's slightly better than S Starlight or S Brilliant basically. If you activated the car's chip and awaken it, again, as mentioned, natural power plus 2%, that takes effect for the whole race, unlike S Starlight which increases natural power by 20% but for 15 seconds only after you use natural 6 times. Both similar performance, different downside. Stargazer doesn't increase speed unlike what Starlight does, but again, 
you need to use natural six times for the speed increase to take effect. So apparently, the top of all that, it's 60% chance it can overtake Starlight. Well, I guess that's pretty much it for a Stargazer review. Awoken Stargazer. Thank you guys for watching. This is Lawrence18. Signing off.